What's going on guys, it's me Brain here from BML Aviation coming at you with another Gemini Jets 1400 scale review. Um, this time we have the American Airlines Boeing 767-200 and the flagship independence tail, I should say, not really colors. Um, anyway, so we'll just set the model aside and we will look at the box real quick here. We have the model up here. Uh, American Airlines 167. Information about Gemini Jets. Plane climbing. What does it get? Stuff like that. And then inside the flap here, we get the place where the plane go. Um, we go. Hey, you want to pause? Read that. And pause to read that. Um, so this is actually a surprisingly small box. It's not that big. Well, I was really surprised how it's not actually a very big box. It's the same size as the Delta box that I have, the Delta 737. It's the same size, which is pretty surprising. Um, I was surprised by that, actually. Um, so anyways, the model here, it is, um, in the old American colors. Um, yeah, so let's take a look at the model, um, let's start with the reason it's called Flagship Independence. We'll start right there at the tail, basically honoring our veterans in support of all who serve, as you can see there. Mm -hmm. There we go. So we'll get it from the back this time. Not nice detailing on the tail here. American flag. Um, let's move down the tail. There is the flagship independence. Um, there is the registration N three two D A A. Uh, what is this? I think that just happens to your because I think this is a Chrome model. It starts to do that after a while. You can see there. Anyways, um, wings. Uh, there is no wing tips on this model. Let's see, we have the nav lights there. Really nice wing detail. We have the exit signs on the wings, flaps. We'll look at the engines or the engine. Um. Landing light right there, right there. Um, American colors with the American right there. Back here, for us to say, there is the cargo door, and there is the front cargo door. So then we have the main door here. Man, it's not focusing today, really. Anyway, so there's another flagship independence, and this the thing, I don't know if that red thing on the door is just maybe a dot, but I do not see a one world on here. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's one world on here. Um, anyways, go to the front of the plane, where we usually start, but, I can't focus. No windshield wipers on this one. We have the front, the blue coming in, the white and the red. And then same thing basically on the other side. So um, we'll go and we'll flip the model over. And then look at it from under. We have the uh, nose gear here. Nice detailing on the nose gear. Um, belly view. Got the main landing gear back here. Some nice detail, Gemini jets with the stand. Here's another look at the engines from the bottom and the wings from the bottom. And then we got the chrome look again as you come to the top. And there's a little hatch back there. So this is a really nice model. I really do like the model. Um, would I recommend getting it? No, probably because American isn't. Gonna be using this 
live here anymore, but it is a nice model, so if you find it cheap anywhere, I would get it. Um, yeah, so uh, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, most importantly, subscribe, and goodbye.